Draco is a constellation in the far northern sky. Its name is Latin for dragon. It was one of the 48 constellations listed by the 2nd century astronomer Ptolemy and remains one of the 88 in modern constellations today. The north pole of the ecliptic is in Draco. Draco is circumpolar and can be seen all year from northern latitudes. Notable features. Stars Thaban was the northern pole star from 3942 BC, when it moved farther north than Theta Bootis, until 1793 BC. The Egyptian pyramids were designed to have one side facing north, with an entrance passage geometrically aligned so that Thaban would be visible at night. Due to the effects of precession, it will again be the pearl star around the year AD 21000. It is a blue-white giant star of magnitude 3.7, 309 light-years from Earth. The traditional name of Alpha Draconis, Thaban, means head of the serpent. There are two other stars above magnitude 3 in Draco. The brighter of the two, and the brightest star in Draco, is Gamma Draconis, traditionally called Etaman or Eltanen. It is an orange giant star of magnitude 2.2, 148 light years from Earth. The aberration of starlight was discovered in 1728 when James Bradley observed Gamma Draconis. Beta Draconis, traditionally called Rastarban, is a yellow giant star of magnitude 2.8, 362 light-years from Earth. Its name shares a meaning with Thaban, head of the serpent. Draco is home to several double stars and binary stars. Eta Draconis is a double star with a yellow-hued primary of magnitude 2.8 on a white-hued secondary of magnitude 8.2 located south of the primary. The two are separated by 4.8 arc seconds. Mu Draconis, traditionally called Aurakis, is a binary star with two white components, magnitude 5.6 and 5.7. The two components orbit each other every 670 years. The Aurakis system is 88 light years from Earth. New Draconis is a similar binary star with two white components, 100 light years from Earth. Both components are of magnitude 4.9 and can be distinguished in a small amateur telescope or a pair of binoculars. Omicron Draconis is a double star divisible in small telescopes. The primary is an orange giant of magnitude 4.6, 322 light-years from Earth. The secondary is of magnitude 7.8. Sidraconus is a binary star divisible in binoculars and small amateur telescopes, 72 light-years from Earth. The primary is a yellow-white star of magnitude 4.6 and the secondary is a yellow star of magnitude 5.8. 16 Draconis and 17 Draconis are part of a triple star 400 light-years from Earth, divisible in medium-sized amateur telescopes. The primary, a blue-white star of magnitude 5.1, is itself a binary with components of magnitude 5.4 and 6.5. The secondary is of magnitude 5.5 and the system is 400 light-years away. 20 Draconis is a binary star with a white-hued primary of magnitude 7.1 and a yellow-hued secondary of magnitude 7.3 located east-northeast of the primary. The two are separated by 1.2 arc seconds at the maximum and have an orbital period of 420 years. As of 2012, the two components are approaching the maximum separation. 39 Draconis is a triple star 188 light years from Earth, divisible in small amateur telescopes. The primary is a blue star of magnitude 5.0, the secondary is a yellow yellow star of magnitude 7.4, and the tertiary is a star of magnitude 8.0. The tertiary appears to be a close companion to the primary. 40 Draconis and 41 Draconis are a binary.
binary star divisible in small telescopes. The two orange dwarf stars are 170 light years from Earth and are of magnitude 5.7 and 6.1. Our Draconis is a red Myra type variable star with a period of about 18 months. Its average minimum magnitude is approximately 12.4, and its average maximum magnitude is approximately 7.6. It was discovered to be a variable star by Hans G. Elmiden in 1876. The constellation contains the star recently named Kepler 10 which has been confirmed to be orbited by Kepler 10b, the smallest rocky Earth-sized planet yet detected outside of the solar system. Deep Sky Objects One of the deep sky objects in Draco is the Cat's Eye Nebula, a planetary nebula approximately 3,000 light-years away that was discovered by English astronomer William Herschel in 1786. It is ninth magnitude and was named for its appearance in the Hubble Space Telescope, though it appears as a fuzzy blue-green disk in an amateur telescope. NGC 6543 has a very complex shape due to gravitational interactions between the components of the multiple star at its center, the progenitor of the nebula approximately 1,000 years ago. It is located 9.6 arc minutes away from the north ecliptic pole to the west-northwest. It is also related to IC 4677, a nebula that appears as a bar 1.8 arc minutes to the west of the Cat's Eye Nebula. In long-term exposures, IC 4677 appears as a portion of a ring surrounding the planetary nebula. There are several faint galaxies in Draco, one of which is the lenticular galaxy NGC 5866 that bears its name to a small group that also includes the spiral galaxies NGC 5879 and NGC 5907. Another is the Draco Dwarf Galaxy, one of the least luminous galaxies with an absolute magnitude of minus 8.6 and a diameter of only about 3,500 light-years, discovered by Albert G. Wilson of Lowell Observatory in 1954. Another dwarf galaxy found in this constellation is PGC 39058. Draco also features several interacting galaxies and galaxy clusters. One such massive cluster is Abel 2218, located at a distance of 3 billion light-years. It acts as a gravitational lens for even more distant background galaxies, allowing astronomers to study those galaxies as well as Abel 2218 itself. More specifically, the lensing effect allows astronomers to confirm the cluster's masses determined by X-ray emissions. One of of the most well-known interacting galaxies is ARP-188, also called the Tadpole Galaxy, named for its appearance, which features a tail of stars 280,000 light-years long. The Tadpole Galaxy is at a distance of 420 million light-years. The tail of stars drawn off the Tadpole Galaxy appears blue because the gravitational interaction disturbed clouds of gas and sparks star formation Q1634 plus 706 is a quasar that holds the distinction of being the most distant object usually visible in an amateur telescope. At magnitude 14.4, it appears star-like, though it is at a distance of 12.9 billion light-years. The light of Q1634 plus 706 has taken 8.6 billion years to reach Earth, a discrepancy attributable to the expansion of the universe. The Hercules Corona Borealis Great Wall, possibly the largest known structure in the universe, covers a part of the southern region of Draco. Mythology Dragons in Greek mythology that may have inspired the constellation's name include Ladon, 
the dragon who guarded the golden apples of the Hesperides. Hercules killed Ladon during his twelve labors. He was tasked with stealing the golden apples. The constellation of Hercules is depicted near Draco. In Greco-Roman legend, Draco was a dragon killed by the goddess Minerva and tossed into the sky upon his defeat. The dragon was one of the gigantes who battled the Olympic gods for ten years. As Minerva threw the dragon, it became twisted on itself and froze at the cold north celestial pole before it could right itself. Sometimes, Draco is represented as the demon son of Gaia, Typhon. Traditional Arabic astronomy does not depict a dragon in modern-day Draco, which is called the Mother Camels. Instead, two hyenas, represented by Ita Draconis and Zeta Draconis are seen attacking a baby camel, which is protected by four female camels, represented by Beta Draconis, Gamma Draconis, Nu Draconis, and She Draconis. The nomads who own the camels are camped nearby, represented by cooking tripod composed of Upsilon, Tau, and Sigma Draconis. In some mythology, Draco had 100 magnificent heads, guarded the golden apple tree, and was put in the sky as a constellation for protecting the apples with valor. The constellation has been subject to many more myths, but ones that are obscure. Meteor Showers The February 8 Draconids are a meteor shower that was discovered on February 4, 2011. Observers noted six meteors with a common radiant in a short period. Its parent is a previously unknown long-period comet, named Sex. Astraco was a United States Navy crater-class cargo ship named after the constellation. The main character in the 1996 film Dragonheart gets his name from this constellation. The film also reveals that Draco is actually a dragon heaven, where dragons go when the time in this world is complete, and if they have upheld the oath of an ancient dragon to guard mankind, with dragons otherwise fading in do nothing upon the deaths. At the conclusion of the film, Draco, the last dragon, ascends into the constellation after he sacrifices himself to destroy an evil king that he had saved years ago. The chess opening called the Dragon Variation of the Sicilian Defense was also named after the constellation by Russian chess master Fyodor Dostoevsky. The Beyblade Lightning El Drago 100HF and its evolutions Mateo El Drago LW105 LF and El Drago Destructor F. S are inspired by, based on the Draco constellation. They all feature three dragon heads chasing each other in a counterclockwise motion, possibly referencing Ladin's multiple heads. Draco Malfoy, an antagonist in the Harry Potter series, received his name from the constellation as well.